Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm going to be doing a new thing now where I try to do at least two videos a day. One Walking Dead and one Funko Pop related because I'm not, it's not like I'm not into Walking Dead as much, trust me. Um, I'm in a very much Walking Dead mood at the moment and I feel bad because I haven't uploaded a Walking Dead video in a while. So this chair's a little weird. Um, uh, so funny story though, I tried to film this already and I fell off my chair and it did not work out. But so yeah. Today we're going to be doing my top 10 favorite, well actually no, my top 10 most wanted Funko Pops to pick up in 2018. These are not all Funko Pops in that are coming out in 2018, but they're just Funko Pops that have already came out that I want in 2018. Just so you guys know as well that we will have a picture right here so you guys can see the Funko Pops that I'm wanting to pick up in 2018. But let's just get right into it. So at number 10 we have the Game of Thrones Vizier messed this up earlier when I tried to film it. Vizierian with Night King. It's a pop ride. It's the Night King. You guys will see it right here, but it's the Night King on the dragon. So it looks really, really cool, and I'm really hoping to pick it up. At number nine, we have the 8-inch Chewbacca with the ATST. It's a pop deluxe for Star Wars. It looks very awesome. That does come out this year along with the Game of Thrones one. So those are just two, you know, that are coincidentally on here that are coming out this year, but they're really cool. And mostly the ones that have already came out that I want to pick up personally have already came out. So that's why a lot of them, most of them at least, are coming out in 2018, but some of them are coming, like, back, a little, or going back a little bit. Next up, we have Stranger Things 8-Bit Funko Pops. For Stranger Things 8-Bit Funko Pops, I already have two of them right here. I have Mike and Eleven, and I want to pick up, as you guys can see, the Demogorgon. I want to get Dustin, Lucas... Chase Demogorgon, because that'll complete my set. But these are really cool pops, and of course, if I didn't like these, I wouldn't pick them up. So I'm really excited, and I hope that they come out with more. They are coming out with a barb one as well for Stranger Things that's exclusive to Emerald City Comic Con, so I'm hoping I can get my hands on that. If not, that'll be a big bummer, so I'm going to try to get it as soon as possible. But now, we're moving on to the next one. At number 7, we have the Flash Funko Pops. I do already have the Zoom one, but I want the regular Flash, Reverse Flash... The Flash Unmasked, Gorilla Grodd, I know they're coming out with more too, because they had a poll on, Funko web on Funko's website the other day that like, said vote for the new Flash Funko Pops you guys want. So I personally voted for Killer Frost, uh, Reverse Flash, uh, Savitar would be so awesome, hopefully they make it a 6 inch, hopefully they're smart enough to do that. But anyways, I'm really into the Flash Funko Pops and I'm hoping that they'll come out with more, I hope that wasn't just like a silly survey they put on their website, and I'm really looking forward to getting more of those. At number 6 guys, we have the Pennywise and Georgie Vinyl Funko Pops. Uh, this looks so cool, and the reason that they're all 2 packs, all the vinyls are 2 pack, is because there's no eye in vinyl. So. I'm really digging these two packs. I actually don't personally own any. I want to get the two uh, Stranger Things ones. I'm really digging this one. And, of course, there is another vinyl on this list as well. It's actually the next one. The next one that I would like to pick up is the Harry and Hagrid vinyl two-pack. Again, there's no eye in vinyl, so they have to include two in them. And I'm very happy that they picked the Hagrid and the Harry. Because those are going to look cool, and they're going to look... Really cool on my Harry Potter shelf. Along with the Stranger Things ones. And if they made a Walking Dead one, that'd be cool if they made like a Rick and Daryl or Rick and Negan. Rick and Michonne would be cool. Maybe if they made two, they could do Rick and Michonne, Glenn and Maggie. I don't know. They, they could do a lot of stuff They could, for vinyl. Okay, guys. So, we're already at number four. And for the for number four, um, we, I have all the Pennywise Funko Pops. You know, the ones that I already have already came out. I have the FY exclusive, but I want the Walmart exclusive. I want the Hot Topic exclusive. I want the regular. I want the Chase. I want all of them. They're good. They're so cool, and I want them all. And I, I'm, they're coming out with new ones as well, so I'll pick those up if I ever see them. They're coming out with the Losers Club. So, fit, again, fit, Finn Wolfhard will get another Funko Pop of himself because he's been in some pretty popular things. Stranger Things, It. Really cool stuff, and it as well comes out on DVD tomorrow, so I'm definitely going to be getting that as soon as possible. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited for that, and they're also supposed to be coming out with another Pennywise, so I'm really excited for this new it line that they're going to be doing, and I hope that I can pick them up, and I hope you guys can as well if you're interested. Number three, we have all the new Harry Potter ones. So first up for the Harry Potter ones, we have Ginny and Ron on Broom, but I also want to pick up past ones, like... There's quite a few that I missed out on. I still need the original Harry Potter. Um, I really want to get some of the Hot Topic exclusives, like Cedric Diggory, um, Bellatrix in her prisoner uniform, Lucy Smalfoy in mask. 
there's just so many that are exclusive to Hot Topic, and I miss out on so many. I also still do need the Ronin sweater. I have the hairy one, but I am missing out on a lot at this point, and I need to catch up. And just some originals that are cool. Like, if I ever see another Dolores Umbridge for 5 bucks at FYE, I'm definitely going to grab it, and I'll definitely put it in my collection. And number two, guys, we have all the new Stranger Things Funko Pops. We have the 6-inch Demogorgon. We have the Demodog open, and then the Chase version, which is closed down here. Um, I don't know any of the other ones. Well, obviously, they're going to be making Season 3 ones. Um, I don't know exactly what those will look like because we haven't even got the Season 3 trailer yet. So, we have no idea what they look like. But, I'm sure Funko doesn't either because I'm pretty sure it hasn't even been filmed. Anything's been filmed yet. But, uh, so yeah, guys, huge Stranger Things fan here. Also, I do want to pick up past Stranger Things ones. I still need the second wave with uh, Brenner, Eleven, Nancy, and Jonathan. I do have Hopper, but I need to catch up. And then also, I'm a little bit behind. I want some of the I want the Ghostbusters ones like Mike, Lucas, and Will. And then I also would like to get the original Max. That would be a cool one. I'm really behind on some of these Funko Pops, and I need to pick them up. So now my number one. Is you guys probably already know because if it hasn't been on this list already, it's gonna be the number one, and that is the new wave of Walking Dead Funko Pops. I'm so stoked for these. I could not be happier for them. We not only have Negan, a new version. We also have King Ezekiel, Richard, Sasha, Eugene, Zombie Sasha. Like there's so many. Oh yeah, forgot the best one or one of them, Daryl. I'm so excited for these guys. They're going to be awesome. And I do want to pick up some of the past ones, like maybe mostly the Walkers and a Glenn one. I do want to get either the Riot Gear Glenn, the Prisoner Gear Glenn, or just the original Glenn from Season 1. Along with, I do want to pick up Teddy Bear Girl, Well Walker, RV Walker. There's a lot of cool ones that I don't have, and I need to get them. So that is it for today's video. Catch my Walking Dead one later today. I'm probably going to be either discussing the new issue, issue 175, or I'll be doing the topic about Oceanside and how, what's that going to do in Season 8, because I haven't made a video about that. I haven't seen too many people discussing it, and it'd be pretty cool if I got to be able to, if I got to be the first one to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoy it. Leave some comments down below. Tell me what this video, how you guys liked it, if you guys liked it, some new video ideas. Thank you guys for watching this, and I'll see you guys next time.